Hello everyone, this is Gamma Edits, and once again, here's a quick PowerPoint tutorial within 3 minutes. In a blank slide, click on the Insert tab and click on Text Box, and then drag the text box just like this one. Next is to type the minus sign 10 times. Now select all the text, and we are going to change the font to area black and its size to 100. While selecting those, click on the Shape Format tab and then click on Text Effects. And under the Transform section, choose a Warping Design. Let's try the Deflate option first, so let's click this one. Now is to adjust the size of the text box so that the lines will follow its size. Make sure that the lines are positioned centered and aligned in the middle. To do that, click on the shape format and under the align click on align to center and align to middle now select the text box to add photos just right click and then click on format shape the shape options is selected here but we need the text options so click on that make sure that no line is toggled for the text outlined and for the text field click on the picture or texture field then click on the insert and then from file and then select a photo of your choice and with that we have added the background photo of the warp text you can also add your text for additional design now let's try to duplicate this slide let's try to change the warp effect for this so we can try this by just selecting all the lines go back to shape format text effect transform and we can try this wave up this one looks really nice so let's try to duplicate it once again and change it again let's try this wave down and that is also cool let us just adjust it here and that is perfect so this trick is really good and this kind of presentation is for you if you want to showcase a different set of photos in a unique and eye-catching style. So that's basically it. I hope you learned something new from this tutorial. If you have any questions, suggestions, just comment down below. Again, this is Gamo Edits and thank you for watching.